okay so now uh, i shall estimate the pearson correlation correlation coefficient right coefficient that uh, that uh, i shall estimate now and here uh, here the thing is that uh, we have three variable export import and consumption and i i assume that and i assume that these three variables are normally distributed right normally distributed that i assume and uh, you know the the data the variable actually is continuous variable in nature so so now we can run the pearson correlation coefficient because the variables are continuous in nature and secondly the variables are normally distributed so we can run the so i click on the analyze then correlate then bivariate so uh, oh, oh, so oh, oh, what is this bivariate means between two variable the association shape between any two variable or or the or the co correlation between any two variable so i choose bivariate so uh, you can see our three variables so so what i do and the, and this one is our variable box right so what i do i select all the variables by pressing on the co control button of the co computer i choose all select all and i press here all variable has come here right export import and consumption okay then uh, then actually there are many methods to estimate the correlation coefficient such as pearson method kendall's method and spearman method out of three method uh, uh, here we have chosen pearson method why because i assume that our variables are normally distributed and secondly the variables are continuous in nature so so i think pearson uh, should be the the most appropriate method when the variable are continuous and normally distributed okay test of significance so here i have chosen two tail test i have chosen two tail test not one tail so here i have chosen two tail test right then uh, if everything is all right then uh, i can proceed for for our uh, for a, for a estimating the co correlation between two variable i press on the okay so the result is coming up gradually yes it is appeared here so 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 the screen is uh, mega getting bigger so the screen has become big now the whole thing ha has been visible uh, so this one actually called correlation matrix this one is the correlation matrix 
So here we can see we have three variables, right? You can see export, import, and consumption. So these variables are here and also here, right? It is here and also here. And you can see there are three, four, nine boxes, right? Total nine boxes are here. But there is a always uh, same boxes here. There is a uh, same boxes are here, such as this box and this box is the same. This box and this box is the same. This box and this box is the same. So these are all same. The this part, the corner part, the diagonal part, all are same. But this one and this one is same. This one, this one is same. This one and this one is same. Right? No difference. Just the image. Just the image of the boxes here. And you can see this is a star. You can see star means correlation is significant at 5% level. So 0 0.05 means 5% level. So this star is only available here, only here, not also here, only here and here. But this and this is same, no difference. But this star only here, not in other place. You see there is no other star like this nowhere is like this only here and here okay now now i talk about uh, about suppose this value this coefficient right this value it is how much 0 0.358 right it is 0 0.358 